What's good with a new YouTube man? It's your boy Sway. Uh, let me stop my screen record right now. Anyway, I'm here with another reaction video. Of course, as y'all already know, I'm here with the reaction videos, man. This right here is gonna be uh, make sure before I even tell you what video this is, you already read the title below. That's why you clicked on it anyway. Um, subscribe to the page, you know. Subscribe to my second channel, Brandon Too Funny. I'm supposed to be doing some uh, gaming on there, you know. Yeah, nobody subscribing, so I'm not doing no gaming. I ain't posting nothing on there. But I'm back with these reaction videos for y'all, man. But this one's gonna be Ricky Police Officer. Suspended after throwing two sisters by the hair outside of school. And you know who did the don't get a day? Charlemagne the God. If y'all don't know who Charlemagne is, y'all go Google Charlemagne because Charlemagne don't care what he's saying. So with that being said, make sure you like and share this video. Uh, the more likes is the better it help me. So, you know, uh, do that. And I'm going to just try to bring a lit ass reaction video to y'all. And, you know, we got to keep it family friendly kind of. But we're just going to get with this reaction video. Hey, man, mm -mm 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 Let's see what this is. Let's see what this is gonna be. Donkey of the day does not discriminate. I might not have the Donkey of the day does discriminate. Who's Donkey of the day today? Yes, Donkey of the day for Monday, October 16th goes to a New Jersey police officer named Hanifa Davis. Now, a video was posted. On WorldStarHipHop.com over Ooh, the weekend, that we don't have that video. Named Hanifa Davis, forcibly detaining two twin sisters, Kaija and Naija Sorrells, and well. manhandling Principal Muhammad Abdelaziz. Abdelaziz. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my brother Muhammad, apologies for butchering your last name, but I do want to salute you because you are a true hero, sir. Drop one of those bombs for Muhammad, damn it. So I guess yeah. Muhammad probably whooped that ass on that point. Well, he didn't whoop that ass as a police officer, but but he probably stood up. We just gonna say that. Not too many people intervene when it comes to police officers brutalizing. I know I'm not intervening with a goddamn thing with a guy. Mm -mm. If you got anything to do with the police, have you always said yes, I'm asking? Mm -mm. I ain't got time for that. I'm sorry, sir. And you did so, so salute to you. You are a warrior. Mm -hmm. Now back you to are, You are a warrior. Today. Salute to you because I'm hell with that. I'm sorry. It's 10 o'clock. I just knew when Envy told me about this video this morning that it was a white police officer manhandling two black queens from Orange, New Jersey. I feel bad that I have been... Con See, that, that's bad that we have to think like that. But then again, you know you got them Uncle Tom, you got, you know you got them Uncle Tom police officers that think that you know. And you know what, I'm going to keep my comments to myself. I shouldn't have think that way, but that's where my mind went. We have seen that on videos before, white cops manhandling sisters. Of so course. I heard about the story this morning. That's immediately what I thought. I was saddened <laughs> and deeply disappointed when I found out that the cop in question was black. Anifa Davis was a black man. He black, right? He Damn. Like me. Okay. Now, we always say we need more black people in law enforcement. The reason we need more black people um, is because they I don't know about that. Some of them take the authority to their head. To deal with black people better simply because they are black, but this lame ass so called man and he <laughs> didn't get the memo on why we need more black cops. Now before I go off on a tangent, let's get more He's making it work situation courtesy of ABC seven New York. Fellow students walked out of Orange High School to Damn. protest what they say was excessive force. The video raises a lot of questions. First, why are, are the kids being held down in the first place? Since cops say there was no report of a fight or incident before this happened. Also, after, after, all this, after all this going on, your black ass gonna do that. After all this, sir, after all this going on, your black ass gonna grab them girl by the head like this. Look, for, look, look at the example. You grabbing it, not, what if somebody grab your daughter by the head? And snatch her ugly ass weave out her head. Then what? The officer yanked one of the girls to the ground by pulling on her hair. Look at this, look, look at this. troubling video has been identified as Hanif Davis, who's been on the Orange Police Force for just three and a half months. The girls in the video are 17-year-old twins, Kaija and Naija Soro. The school's principal even tried to intervene on behalf of the girls and ended up being put in a headlock. The incident led wow. to suspension and the police department... He probably didn't get no ass at home. That's, a, that's, that's the conclusion. Oh, he got beat up in school, and he finally got something. Let authority. He let authority go to his head. One of the two, but I don't know. That's wrong. Why a school administrator was poorly treated. And the administrator that you saw in the video was given a ticket, but not arrested. As a for ticket the girls, for what? They face charges in juvenile court. Now, what? to add insult to injury, yes, they do face charges in juvenile court. They've been charged with aggravated assault, obstruction of justice, 
and three other charges. How? how? Yeah, how? I don't know. Now, I am the father. They didn't grab the police with his bald head ass. Father, father, I am sitting back watching anybody put their hands on my seats. Police officers out there, you know, right. can hear me. Seriously. Seriously, think about this. Do you understand the position you put me in as a man when you put your hands on my kids? Hmm. Especially my daughters. How do you expect me just to sit back and watch that happen? Sit back, I could nothing. Sit back and watch that I'm happen. Not. If it wasn't my kids, that's why I have to salute the principal, Muhammad Abdel Aziz. I, I know I'm butchering you. Definitely <laughs> butchering you. <laughs> but I have to salute you so much because he could have easily turned a blind eye, mm -hmm. like so many people do in that. You're right. You're right. See, in that situation, I, I'll take that back. In that situation, you're not gonna turn a blind eye. But then again, you sometimes you have to turn a blind eye because the way these police officers are, you don't know what they're gonna do. They might pop. They, Boom. And then look what you, you know, and you just got to be situational. You got to have a situation, situa situational instinct in that, in that particular to me. We have daughters and nieces or sisters. And I know that police officer got some daughter with this stank ass weave in the head. A mother, I'm sure. A wife, maybe. Right. I'm sure he has some type of woman in his life that he cares about. And now, what is about to guy your mama by the head? Now, what if we just about a guy who grab your mom by the head? Then what you you'll be mad, right? They take that into consideration. Or what if I grab your wife, like or like I say, your daughter, by the weave and the wig and whatever, snatch that shit off? Then what? To be the woman he loves on that ground, being manhandled by those cops, and this is what I don't understand about you, Hanifa Davis. You don't have any women in your life that you love. Right. You have daughters. Sisters, he got a woman he loves. I know you got a mother. What would you do if I any know. man, cop or not, was manhandling your mother the way you manhandled Kaeja and Naeja Sorrells? Well, Hanifa Davis has been suspended, but he needed to be fired, and he should never work for any police They're not going to fire no police. They, they take up for their police. Fellowship man. from the black community. You know how Jehovah Witnesses, the fellowship mm -hmm. their members, when they violate codes of conduct? That's what we have to do to this brother, this fellowship. They ain't going to okay? do it. Okay, nobody speak to him anymore. He's not one of us. He should be ostracized from the black community. Damn. Mr. Davis, you're supposed to be one of the cops, right? That helps change the narrative about the police. We want more black cops he not. to help scrimmage he making it worse. between cops and police. A black we man. want black cops in law enforcement to show the white cops who may not know how to interact with us how to interact with us. What's the point of being in that position if you're going to act just like them? You show them how to whip our ass smoke. Mr. Davis, you are disfellowship from the black community. I pray that your family doesn't invite you to Thanksgiving dinner this year. Okay, <laughs> you don't deserve no turkey, no stuffing, mm -hmm. no mac and cheese. You don't eat nothing. No ribs, no rice, no champagne, okay? I pray, Hanif Davis, that every time you go to Starbucks, they say coward or sellout on your life. <laughs> you should wake up this morning and every morning for the rest of your life ashamed and embarrassed. You should be ashamed of yourself leaning in the mirror. Give Hanif Davis the biggest hee please. Please, give it to him. So damn disrespectful. I mean, come on, man. We need more of us in law enforcement just to show the ones how to do it the right to way. How, how to treat, treat us, exactly. What kind of See? example are you setting, Hanifa Davis? Imagine the trauma for those what young people. What kind of man, what kind of man is you? Little ass boy, still living at his mama house? Is now, when they see cops. Come on, and they got, they got charged with assault? And obstruction of justice? Don't charge them, they should be dropped. They should be dropped. Crazy. They should be dropped. But, not, but like you said, just now, just imagine that, that those girls' father. Come on, now you're going to put me in a bad for dick with because hey, you, put my, you put hands on my baby girl, father, I got to put hands on you. Oh, and you are the law, so if I put hands on you, now I'm going to catch a charge. Yeah, exactly. But guess what? Eddie, it's, it's worth it. It's worth it. You got to. Come on. In that you're right. Situation, damn right. You damn you're skippy. There's a cop out there who would allow that to happen to their kids. Not so at why all. would you do it to somebody else's kids? Not Stop at it. all. Don't Stop. that girl by her hair. Right. What the is wrong with you? That is crazy, man. This is what I want y'all to do. Put down below in the comment box what y'all think about this situation. What you would do is somebody put your hand, put their hands on your daughter. And then if it's the police, what, what would you do? Because see me, we, we gonna have some trouble, trouble. Hell with that. Um, but anyway, man, make sure y'all put a thumbs up on this video, man. Get my name out there. I bring the reaction videos. Uh, subscribe to the page if you're new. I'm bringing, I'm bringing reaction videos. I'm trying, y'all. I'm trying. It's just so much, man. I try to be consistent with it. Then I drop, I drop out. I'm not going to drop out on y'all no more, man. You know, I'm going to be consistent. I'm going to top it up. At least a video. At least I'll give, give y'all one or two videos a day, you know. But, um, I guess with that being said, man, uh, like I said, like, share this video. Subscribe to the page if you're new. Subscribe to my second channel down below in the description box. Follow me on live raises so I go live and get, do giveaways and all that. And with that being said, man, your boy Squack is out. It's the speaker knockers. Every day I think about the money. Let's go.
what am I gon' do with all this money? I can't go a day without my money, no You know that I'm married